Welcome to This Week in Dinosaurs for the week of February 21st, 2016. Time Out Melbourne has released more details on Jurassic World The Exhibition, as well as some new images showing off an impressive Pachyrhinosaurus. Jurassic World The Exhibition opens next month at the Melbourne Museum in Australia and will run through October. The exhibition will immerse guests in scenes inspired by the blockbuster film. The lifelike animatronic dinosaurs are being designed by Melbourne-based company Creature Technology. Their credits include The Walking with Dinosaurs Show and The Giant Puppet for the musical version of King Kong. They have teamed up with Universal Pictures, Museum Victoria, and the U.S. design group Imagine Exhibitions to place highly realistic life-size dinosaurs in sophisticated environments. In addition to the incredible Pachyrhinosaurus, audiences will experience a 7-meter tall Brachiosaurus the ferocious T-Rex, and maybe even catch a glimpse of the terrifying Indominus Rex. After its initial run for eight months in Australia, it will embark on a five-year-long global tour. In paleontological news, paleontologists have shed new light on some unusual dinosaur tracks in northern China. The tracks appear to have been made by four-legged sauropod dinosaurs, yet only two of their feet have left prints. Previous studies have suggested that the dinosaurs, which were far too big to walk on their hind legs, might have been swimming. Now, a new study of fossil trackways from the Gansu province in northern China has provided evidence that some feet-only tracks were produced by walking, not swimming animals. There is evidence that the animals were walking on soft sand. Most of the animal's weight was towards the rear, and so the hind feet pressed deeper. The front feet, on the other hand, did not apply enough pressure to make a lasting mark. This is not to say that sauropods do not swim. The loss of handprints is down to sedimentology and not dinosaur behavior. To stay up to date on dinosaur news, visit dinosaurstop.com. That's all for this week. And until next time, rawr!